So here's how you find the greatest common factor, the GCF for 21 and 30. So the GCF, sometimes you'll see it called greatest common factor, greatest common divisor, or highest common factor. They're all the same thing. So here's how we do it. For 21, we want to write the factors that go evenly into 21. So 1 times 21, that equals 21 to 3 times 7. That would do it. 3 times 7, that's 21. That's it, though. For 30, 1 times 30, 2 times 15 would be 30. 3, 4, 5 times 6 is 30. Um, oops, I missed 3 times 10. That would be 30 as well. So these are the factors of 30, factors of 21. We want to find the greatest common factor. So 1, that's a factor of both 21 and 30. 3, that's a factor. And actually, there's no more. So 3 is the greatest common factor. That's the greatest factor that goes into 21 and 30. So in answer to our question, the GFC for 21 and 30 is 3. There are other ways to do this, but for smaller numbers like this, it's probably the best way. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.